All right, guys, I got this uh, ammo mule, M8 A1 ammo mule, almost done. It's got a few more weld joints I got to weld up, but pretty much everything's on it. Uh, it's got the VIN plate on it, the jack, 7,000 pound um, towing safety cables. And you have a seven pin wire harness. Uh, we got your box here that holds a propane tank and four jerry cans, two gas and two water if you want. Stays in the red cell. Uh, we got the Saspa strut on the lid, so that'll hold that up. I went with a flat gusset system this time. I just think it looks better. Um, I leave these open so that way you could put a pole in there to extend outward to have create a little shade if you want. Uh, I've got ten hooks on it, ten hooks per on the perimeter of the box. Uh, I've got these heavy duty steps and also if you hit a, a boulder or a tree or whatever it'll push the trailer around it so that's what those are mainly designed for keep the axle safe uh, i got a nice strong quarter inch plate on top of the led lights there's a clear light on the bottom to light up your license plate so that when your license plate sits here it's lit up the rings on the back a nice heavy duty spare tire mount the swing out tailgate swings out to the to the right. Um, we got these nice latches for the lid, keep that safe. Um, we've got a three-inch axle tube, six thousand pound leaf springs, three thousand pounds each. So that's, we got a rear hitch right here, so in case you want to put a you know bike rack on it, it does clear the uh, thirty-five inch uh, tires. The lid here, the lid does go up by itself. D rings, notice the hooks on both sides. Just in case you want to tie something down, a tarp or whatever you want. And that's it, guys. This thing's almost done. Probably another few hours of finish welding the joints up, but it's on Craigslist right now for sale, so check it out. Thanks for watching. Bye.